course, it's exciting as our producers go out to capture some of the incredible things that God is doing. We went and visited James Augusto just a few weeks ago. Take a quick look at this. I came from the streets to jail, to prison. I have a very violent background and a history of organized crime and drug trafficking, etc., etc. And in my house, it was crazy because it was four of us, but we were in four different gangs. And we were at each other, you know. And by me being the youngest, well, you know, I was sort of like a mama's boy in a way. And I loved my mom a lot. She was there for me, you know, no matter what. When my mom died, God convicted me because my mother's friends used to tell me, I used to hear your mother praying for you. One night, I was uh, in the Cook County Jail. All of a sudden, I hear a voice. James, stop doing what you're doing because this night I'm going to open up the doors to your prison. I said, I'm going to start reading the Bible. I said, God, if you're real, I mean, if you're really real, God, you'll change my life. Well, I went to court. The judge said, look, the man's been to prison five times. He's not being rehabilitated. And this big guy got up and uh, he said, my name is Pastor Fernando Avila. He said, let's see what God can do with him. You know what? God opened that door to my prison. And that's been going on like 14 years now. I know now that, you know, God saved me for a purpose. I've gone back to a lot of areas that I used to operate in and minister to a lot of these guys. Evangelist Mars Cirillo, thank you for helping your daily devotionals and watching you on TV and on the internet has helped me. You are one of my mentors. To that person that has lost all hope, call Helpline. You will hear from God.